Chinese chainsaw. 52 cc's. 20 inch barn chain. I assembled it the other day when it got here. I wanted to make sure that it was alright because the box that it came in right here was totally smashed and destroyed and had been taped all back together. The story of this saw starts in uh, late June, early July. My father came to visit. We discussed it and everything. And then I ended up with one. First, first time it came, it came to the wrong address, 45 miles away in a totally another different town. Whatever, got a hold of that person. That person says, oh no, it was never delivered to me. FedEx, absolutely horrible to deal with on it. They took no responsibility. But anyway, here's the saw. Um, as you can see, it does resemble a still in some ways. But it also, you know, got an aluminum case here and everything. And I, I'm not expecting a whole lot. Uh, the saw was, I think, $74 on Amazon. Um, free shipping. It took from... July 6th to September 17th and then it took from September 17th to I do believe October 3rd anyway here it is um, it's anti-vibe so you know that's kind of cool rubber mounted motor it's got a oil uh, adjustment so you can adjust the amount of oil going to your chain did come with these I assembled it already um, pretty sure if you're watching this video you got some idea about a chainsaw so you know to put your chain on your bar on adjust it and tighten it down you got these two bolts hold this cover on but it also holds the bar tight and this screw is your adjustment screw. All right. Now I'm going to pause it here. It does have an old school trigger lock on it. Choke. On switch. All that good stuff. We're going to put some fuel in the fuel tank. Some bar oil in the oil tank. Um, we're going to start this baby up. It says... Uh, to use 25 to 1 so I'll do that I'll let it sit and idle through a whole tank of fuel and then I'll put another tank in it rev it up let it rev down kind of get everything broke in good and then at another point we'll go ahead and cut with it but right now I'm gonna pause it get it all ready take it outside and we'll start this thing all right, got her fueled up, got oil in her. This thing's still right out of the box. This power head is, I mean, everything's assembled, but we're gonna see how it goes, okay? And pull this, pull choke. Put the power switch on, trigger's already set. Let's see. Ooh. 
and she popped off. What was it, about five, six pulls? See how she does now? <laughs>
first tank of fuel. Let's see how she starts. talk about her. Okay. So, there it is. We took it out of the box. I assembled it. It came in a smash box. Okay. So there it is. The chainsaw says on it ironically professional power tools 5200 um, they sell these under like 10 different names they vary in price from the $74 for this to $150 for this exact same saw so, depending on who it is you buy it from, when and where, depends on what you get as far as price-wise. You're going to get the exact same saw, no matter who it is you, you buy it from, that's what you're going to get. I do want to show you this. This kickback brake, this guard, is cheesy. I mean, on this side, see that? Looks nice, right? But it's weak. Look at that. And on this side, I don't know if you can see this or not, but see that? It's all hollow. They couldn't even, like, do a solid. But I guess it's better than none. Like I said, there's... Like this, this molding, this is crazy. This is, uh, like, they didn't even try, <laughs> pretty much. But, uh, for the price, you know. And I could probably take a heat gun and form that a little better myself. I mean, by all means. So, this is what's going to happen. I'm going to use the chainsaw, and we're going to try it out. I mean, we're going to put it through the paces, and uh, I'm not nice to my chainsaws. Um, I use them. I 
sometimes use them for things that they were never intended for. So, we'll do a follow-up on this at a later date. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for future videos. If you like what you're seeing, please comment. Let me know. If you don't like what you're seeing, definitely comment and let me know. Thank you. Mm -hmm.